Hi everybody, I'm here today to show you how to make this fun Valentine's card and what's fun about it is at the inside you will see that the heart pops out and the inside, the outer part of the heart pops out and the inside of the heart goes in. So, I'll set this one aside and I'll show you how I did this. Okay, I did parts of it already. So I layered some of the specialty paper, Sending Love, and then I took the I Love Love wheel, the Stampin' Around wheel, and wheeled a piece and then cut it down and put in the little Pinking Hearts punched border on the bottom in old olive paper. So the next step I need to do is I'm going to take my red cardstock and I'm going to put it down and in the spine I'm going to cut with a hobby blade just a thin, just a cut in the spine there so that I can layer my ribbon over it. Take my ribbon, that I've, the red satin ribbon that I've cut down, put a mini glue dot on it and let's cover up where those two papers meet on the front, put the mini glue dot in there and on the back side. And then we're just going to slip it through, slip it through the little cut I made in the spine and do the same thing. Put another mini glue dot on, just like that, and then fold it over. So now I have the spot where the two papers join covered. Okay, and then the next step I'm going to do is I took the stamp, the heart from the Sweetheart stamp set and the leaves and stem and stamped it on some Whisper White cardstock in red and old olive. Then I took a piece of the sticky pages, cut it out in this heart shape and put down some of the fine Nova, uh, some of the fine glitter to get that glitz on there. So I've already stuck my little dimensionals on the back take those off, the little paper covers, there we go, that one's already sticking up a bit, and get that off, there we go, stick this down to the card front just like that, and take another piece of the red satin ribbon, and I'm just going to tie a knot right around the front, and then I'll trim it down with my scissors, to get the little notched look. So to get the little notched look, what I do is I just fold it in half, top to bottom, and then I'm going to cut up at an angle pointing in toward the knot. So then I'll point up like that and cut, and then do the same to the other side. Fold it in half and cut up to the center. You want to make sure it's folded in the center so that you're cut goes to the center. There we go. And now I have my card front with the ribbon and the shiny glittery heart on the front. So I'm going to set this aside and now I'm going to do the inside. So the next step is to take a piece of the Whisper White cardstock that I've cut to eight and a quarter by five and a quarter so that I'll have a little bit of the red trim showing around. So I've scored it and folded it down the center and now I'm going to ink up my heart from the Sweetheart stamp set and because I have the clear block I can line up the center of the heart on the center of the card. Okay. And then I'm going to take the stem and leaves, ink that up in old olive, and again because I've lined, I can see through the block I'll line it up in the center again just like that. Then I'm going to take this greeting Follow Your Heart, It Knows the Way from the um, Celebration set, Whimsical Words. Ink that up, and I'm inking that up in Regal Rose, and because I can see through, I'm going to ink that up in the center of my heart again. Okay, so I've got just a couple parts to stamp left. I'm going to put the little bird down over in this corner here, and then we'll put the Happy Valentine's Day up over on this side. So that's how I want to do my card. So the next step is to take the paper snips. And I'm going to fold it like this so that I can see where my heart is. And I'm going to just start here and I'm going to trim around the heart. And I'm going to stop and leave some attached so that I don't cut it off. And do the same thing coming up from the bottom around the heart. And again, stop 
that I don't cut the heart out. There's a little bit of a spot attached still. And do the same thing on the inside. Just gonna make sure I cut in there. Do the same thing in here. Come around to the inside. Stop up from the bottom. So that. And oh, I got a little bit of my heart, but that's okay. And stop. So I've left it attached in two spots so that it is still attached. So now I can push my inside of my heart to the inside and pop the outside of my heart to the outside. Just like that. There we go. Kind of make it go where it doesn't want to go at first. So I'm going to just fold that down. You can see the inside of the heart kind of popping there. And then when you open it up, you have the outside or the top of your heart popping up and the inside going inward. So now all that's left is to take some to take some uh, snail adhesive, put that down in here gonna, so I don't attach it where the heart is popping up. Just line that up with the base here. Just like that. Okay, put that over. Put some adhesive here and then place that down. And then you have inside your card the heart that pops up. The inside heart goes to the inside, the outside heart comes to the pop top. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make this pop-out heart. If you have any questions, be sure to go to my website, www.mystamplady.com. Thanks for watching and look for more videos on my YouTube site. Bye-bye.